Hey guys, let's get more news from SAN Francisco 49 ERS, but first don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave your like. 49ers reporter weighs in on 2023 Trey Lance trade rumors. With Brock Purdy declared the San Francisco 49ers QB1 heading into the spring and Sam Darnold in place as a young yet experienced veteran backup quarterback, fans have been wondering what the future holds for Trey Lance, the man John Lynch traded three first-round picks and a third-round pick to acquire back in 2021. Would the 49ers consider trading the 22-year-old after just 262 offensive snaps? In the opinion of Matt Barrows, the 49ers beat writer for The Athletic, the answer to that question should be a resounding no, at least not in 2023. The main reason the 49ers would be reluctant to trade Lance right now is that they need numbers at the position, Barrows wrote. Another reason is that they're probably not getting a huge haul for him. It would be one thing if he'd spent years in the Kyle Shanahan system and had lots of experience under his belt. But the critique of Lance, coming out of the draft, he just doesn't have a lot of in-game reps, remains the same two years later. Maybe they could get a day two pick? I don't know. If the 49ers are truly done with Lance, then trading him now for a day two pick might serve as a chance to get something for nothing in exchange for the third quarterback on their depth chart. Then again, as both Kyle Shanahan and Jed York noted at the NFL Annual League meeting, the 49ers prioritized adding depth this offseason, and it would appear keeping all three young quarterbacks to see which one is worthy of a starting job long term is more valuable than a single day to pick. While Barrows doesn't believe that Lance will be traded in 2023, he did note in his 49ers mailbag that if Lynch wants to recoup some value for the former third overall pick should he lose out on the QB competition, it should likely come in 2023, assuming he's able to raise his value on the field. 2024 trade seems a lot more likely than one in 2023. It would allow Lance to increase his value. And even then, the 49ers could conclude that having multiple, capable quarterbacks is more important than extra draft picks. The 49ers currently have all their 2024 draft picks except their fifth rounder, Christian McCaffrey trade, plus an estimated five compensatory picks. On paper, it makes more sense for a team to trade for Lance now, as they would be afforded one more cost-controlled year with the 22-year-old quarterback under contract, but because he only played 84 offensive snaps in 2022, Barrow's assertion is likely correct, if Lance can see the field and flash some of the offensive talents he showcased at North Dakota State, maybe another team would be willing to trade more assets for Lance, assuming, of course, he's still available. And you fan, what do you think of the Trey Lance situation? Leave your opinion in the comments.